So I think it's fair to say I'm not the greatest goalkeeper in the world. Oh! But after I spent a week training as one, it gave me a newfound respect for playing in goal. So today I'm going to be taking it a step further and attempting to recreate some of the world's best saves. Oh, there's no saving that. So today I'm going to be putting the gloves back on and seeing just how difficult some of the world's best saves really are. I'm going to be seeing how my throwing ability compares to that of a professional. And finally I'm going to be attempting to learn the Danish catch, one of Kasper Schmeichel's signature skills. Okay, so you're going to start off easy for the first save. It's a curl shot, outstretched, sort of medium height in the goal, taps it around the post. Let's try and do it. Okay, so this is the easiest one. Obviously, let me just make a disclaimer by saying, obviously keepers wouldn't know where you're going, but it's more about the athletic ability. Is it possible? I was watching that footage back and realised that this first save just was not a good recreation, so we're back out doing it again. Okay, so I've come to the conclusion that that one's just too difficult because if I stand too far right in the goal, I literally can't stretch to reach over there. But then if I stand too far in the middle, it just makes it too easy, so we should have to move on to the next one. This one is a mad one, number two. So I've got to start off just outside the edge of the box. The ball gets passed on the floor. I've got to run and clear it off the line. Jesus, this is going to be fun. Let's try it out. Okay, so number three, header. Oh, that, that's going to be so difficult. I mean, if I can't do this one, we're going to have to just call it, but. Okay, so to make this sort of realistic, I'm going to be around here. Then we're going to throw it. Mate, these goals seem so big. <laughs> Sweet, how many attempts? About 15. So before we move on to the rest of the saves, I thought I'd have a go at recreating the viral Instagram goalkeeper clips to see how difficult they really are. So the next one is a penalty and it's actually a feet save. So the ball gets struck down the middle of the goal and he kicks it like scissor kicks it away. Let's try it. This relies heavily, Ewan, yeah. on your shot being pretty dead centre. I actually don't know how I'm going to do this. I go low. I like, I like almost drill pass.
but you almost need to commit to a dive on the right. Yeah, I need to, I need to commit. Instead of like... Because we know what's happening, it's not hard to... Get he was there. like full stretch like that, and then like... Chip, chip. <laughs> got one of the most fun ones and probably one of the hardest ones we've got Joe Hart picks the ball up he's running back from his halfway line all the way Joe Hart's running back and just keeps it out So that Joe Hart one was pretty hard to say the least. Now we're going on to number eight, it's by David De Gea. Ball comes in, bounces on the floor, bounces top corner, carries it over the bar. It should be fun, let's try it. Surely a goal here! Oh, how did he keep that out? What a save! and recreate before the throwing in the Danish Cats challenge is the David Seaman save. And I think this one is going to be pretty difficult. So I'm, I'm facing like this. And then you come closer. You're inside the six yard box. So I'm facing like this. I'm not that. It comes around. Like you've got a corner, man. Yeah, and I'll, I'll go. How far does my throw go compared to that of a professional? From this goalkeeper throw, I worked out the target to beat would be 45 meters. Let's see how we compare to the professional goalkeeper. So these were the results of the pro goalkeeper throwing challenge and 45 meters was the target to beat. The first one went about 30 meters, so that's pretty disappointing there. Second one went still about 30 meters. So as you can see, there's one thing I am consistent, but the next one still only went about 30 meters. Probably my best though was maybe about 33 meters overall. As you can see, nowhere near the 45 meter mark. So now we're gonna learn the Danish catch, which is done by Kasper Schmeichel where he sort of brings the ball in, sort of holds his arms like that and catches it in some weird way. Apparently it's a skill they teach in Denmark for goalkeepers, so I've never done this before. Just throw it in soft to start off, I'm just, just like, it's difficult, right? How'd you do it? You can't look like that. And then just, right. Oh, Good, that. I think he's had it. Right, I feel like he's just, I've suddenly just got it now. That's a normal catch, right? Okay. That's Man, that does feel like solid. Yeah. That was a dangerous catch. <laughs> 